Hello everybody, welcome to this video. In this video we are going to talk about how to control LED's brightness. There's two ways to control LED brightness. One way is PWM technique and the other way that we are going to talk about in this video is to use constant current source which is controlled by a voltage signal by using constant current source you are able to set LED's current at certain point which is independent from LED's voltage or color by this technique you will be able to control also power LEDs which uh, require more current like 1 amp, 2 amp or even more depend on your MOSFET current rating to make a constant current source you just need some resistors and op amp and just a MOSFET and also a DC voltage source this circuit has 5 sections the first one is voltage divider by using R1 and R2 resistors and up to control this MOSFET gate and also feedback from output voltage a current limiting resistor to limit the gauge current of this MOSFET and also a shunt resistor to sense the output current and feedback this voltage that is produced in here to op amp to control this MOSFET gate and control this current as you know the MOSFET drain and source current are the same so if you want to control this current you need to control this voltage because this voltage divided by this resistor will make this current that you want to make our desired output voltage we use an op amp and two resistors as voltage divider as you know the positive and negative voltage input of op amp is always the same so if we fix the positive input of op amp the op amp try to make an output that leads to make a current this current will go through these resistors and make some voltage the op amp try to make an output voltage that will make this current this current go through this resistor and this voltage will be equal to this voltage at positive input so by this way we can control this output voltage by setting this V in node to our desired voltage so V in voltage and this output voltage is the same the maximum current of my LED is 20 milliamp so we shouldn't exceed this current because the LED will blow up so to make this current uh, we need maximum voltage of 0 0.02 volt in here at this voltage is divided by this one ohm resistor and make this 20 milliamp current so to do that we need to um, fix this V in node voltage to 0 0.02 volt because this voltage and this voltage will be equal so to fix this node voltage we use two resistor as voltage divider you can use a variable resistor instead of this fixed resistor 
to control the output current so if you change this variable register the output current will be changed too V in voltage equation is in here let's assume that we have a 10 kilo ohm variable resistor so R2 will be equal to 10 kilo ohm and our maximum output voltage is 0 0.02 volt because if you exceed this voltage this current will exceed this LED current rating and this LED will blow up so our desired voltage is 0 0.02 volt R2 is 10 kilo ohm our VCC is 12 volt and you can calculate the R1 value by this equation if you choose a 10 kilo ohm variable resistor it means that its maximum value is 10 kilo so this maximum V in value will be 0 0.02 volt and by varying this variable resistor value you can control this output current so if you change it to 0 ohm this value will be 0 volt and here 0 volt too and this current will be 0 amp and your LED will turn off in this way you can use your own variable resistor and calculate this R1 by this equation you can also use a microcontroller with digital to analog converter to make this your desired voltage and control your LED current. Let's uh, simulate our circuit and see what happens. In here you can use LM324 op amp or UA741 or any type of op amp any generic op amp that you have and also here I use IRFZ44N MOSFET you can use a general um, logic MOSFET but be careful that um, this MOSFET's V threshold voltage should be on logic level so be careful to choose right MOSFET and also consider this current rating I used C1 and C2 in here C1 for filtering noises voltage noises in here and also filtering the debouncing when you changing this variable resistor and also this capacitor to filter noises and also the effect of changing this variable resistor debouncing effect on this output voltage so let's run the simulation and see the output so as you can see the LED is turned on and the LED current is 20 milliamp and the output voltage is 0 0.02 volt and our V in is 0 0.02 volt too so if you want to control this current you need to change this resistor let me change it to for example 5 kilo so if I run the simulation as you can see the output current is 10 milliamp and the output voltage is 0 0.01 volt so the circuit works so thank you for watching this video if you enjoyed it please like it and subscribe to my channel see you in next video